Well, hold on to your seats because this is a crazy, crazy rumor. Ladies and gentlemen, hold on to your seats. If you're like me and you are waiting very patiently for Marvel's Spider-Man news, it seems like this is going to be probably one of the most divisive rumors to date. Now, for those of you that don't know, let's begin with the actual rumor itself. So Hip Hop Gamer has gone out and went ahead and specifically pointed out that he believes, according to his sources, that Marvel's Spider-Man 2 from Insomniac Games will go on ahead and indeed build a multiverse storyline, which means that they're going to take some of the techniques that they used from Ratchet and Clank, where you could go on ahead and travel through rifts and go on ahead and kind of almost like teleport and phase through different dimensions. That mechanic will be implemented in Marvel's Spider-Man 2, which sounds absolutely crazy. It is particularly crazy because if you remember, not that long ago, I made a video that went ahead and talked about an action figure, which was from Miles Morales, that actually specifically mentioned that the Spider-Verse was going to be included in Marvel's Spider-Man 2. Now, at that point in time, we saw very quickly Hasbro come out and say, no, 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 we're so sorry, this was just a mistake. Somebody had posted the bio from across the Spider-Verse onto this action figure, and they made a bit of a mistake, that's all. And we all thought, you know what, that's probably all that happened, really no big deal, that's all. But now that Hip Hop Gamer has come out and said that he believes, according to his sources, the world rifting and a Spider-Verse-like mechanic will be implemented into Marvel's Spider-Man 2, it really does make you then think, hey, hold up, maybe that action figure really did spoil something and Hasbro just quickly backpaneled and tried to stay face by saying, oh no, this was just simply a mistake. Now, the other reason why I feel like, honestly, there's actually a pretty good chance that a Spider-Verse-like idea might be introduced in Marvel Spider-Man 2 is because that's all Marvel has been doing when it comes to Spider-Man that has actually been selling really well on the comic book side of things. All they've done is continuously introduce a billion different Spider-Man and all of it is tied in together via the Spider-Verse mechanic or concept. It also does kind of make sense now that we heard him go on ahead and mention this world shifting idea that Insomniac, the company that worked on Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart, implemented that incredibly cool mechanic. It really did work very well and was a lot of fun to utilize in the game, but it makes sense that Insomniac would then go on ahead and say, hey, why don't we take that mechanic, introduce a Spider-Verse element into our next Spider-Man game using the rifting system. Now, once again, I do know that obviously this is all just a rumor, but it would be very interesting to just start to think obviously conceptually what would be possible here in terms of the idea of introducing tons and tons of Spider-Man into the game and the concept of possibly there actually being a Spider-Verse game next up after Marvel Spider-Man 2. But most importantly, I want to hear from you. How would you feel if Marvel Spider-Man 2, instead of being a story that is very anchored and very similar to the experiences that we had with Marvel Spider-Man and Marvel Spider-Man Miles Morales, where they were very focused on the heroes in question and then obviously building an interesting antagonist or set of antagonists around them for you to go on ahead and defeat? What if this went ahead and really zoomed out and started to scale things way, 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 way higher by introducing a multiversal-like system into this game universe? Again, I guess time will tell. I still do believe that we will be seeing a PlayStation showcase in May. That's based on everything that I've heard personally. It seems like May will be the time that we are going to go on ahead and get a PlayStation showcase. So during that showcase, I think we're going to go on ahead and actually get to see Marvel's Spider-Man 2. And from there, who the heck knows what will happen? Of course, if this is true and there is a multiversal type system being included in this game, obviously it would then explain as to why maybe the Venom that we see is not Venom Harry Osborn. They could really start to play with those concepts quite a bit. And obviously, anytime that you introduce some sort of a multiversal system, you can really get wacky with the sort of stories that you can tell.